Studio City Film Festival. There we go. The one with the bungee cord. Yeah. to have uh, uh, a few incredible legends today. I, I'd like to introduce uh, uh, the amazing and very, very legendary Bill Sharman is here. Yeah. 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 The, the former uh, uh, Boston Celtic great and, and uh, coach of the Lakers and uh, 33 game winning streak. Uh, that still is still the, the, the longest streak in the history of basketball back with Bill Chamberlain and Jerry West, right? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, one of the players was F Flynn Robinson, who's here too. <laughs> Thank you for coming, Flynn. And we also have, a, we're also pleased to have a Dennis Murphy here, who is the founder of the American Basketball Association, yeah. Association and the uh, World Hockey League. Yeah. 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 You're very good to have. I have one thing. Boy. Okay, so um, we have a couple of shorts, and then we're gonna see our feature, which is Jay and Jay. <laughs> Afterwards, we will have a, a, a Q and A with the filmmakers, and uh, also please bear in mind that uh, the sponsors on the back of the program are the are the uh, our restaurant sponsors. Um, we'll give you a, a discount if you if you go into their uh, establishment. How much of a discount? I don't know, but um, but, but they they will take care of you. So please. Thanks so much for coming out at a, kind of an odd time to come to the show, but uh, uh, we'd love to turn out here, and, uh, and thank you so much for supporting the Studio City Film Festival. Frightened. Disappointment. Shocked. 
hope. Confused. Disillusion. Strength. Courage. Hope. Doubt. Survival. Survival. We had an accident where I fell asleep behind the wheel and we rolled off a 100-foot cliff where I was ejected from the car. I wasn't wearing my seatbelt. And I landed on a Joshua tree that uh, broke my back and severed my spinal cord completely. You have metastatic breast cancer. What? I have metastatic breast cancer? And I'm like, I just had cancer. I don't have cancer again. They're both stronger because of their adversity. You know, it's interesting. Um, in many books, including the Bible, it talks about the fact that adversity is one of the strongest things that people can grow from. And if you take the adversity and you have the right attitude and you have the right choices, it can be a big advantage to you. They've taken it from a, a negative to a positive. Jose had a split second decision to decide, is he gonna be happy or bitter? He chose happy. Joanne says she has cancer, but cancer doesn't have her. They both acknowledge that you can look around in any direction and somebody else has it worse. Even though their cases are so brutally compelling in terms of the personal challenges, there are other people that are not as blessed. They consider themselves blessed. Every day they wake up and are thankful. And that's a choice that anybody that's faced with these type of circumstances or any other challenging circumstance can make. They can choose to be optimistic and they can choose to be happy in the face of extremely brutal personal challenges, just as Jose and Joanne have done. The very talented filmmakers who made these films uh, come up to the stage, please, if you don't mind. <laughs> Can you please tell the audience uh, your name and your film? Sure. Uh, my name is Richard Gasparian, and I directed Private War, the film about uh, women overseas fighting. Um, yeah. It's a wonderful movie, and we're, we're very honored to have it uh, here you. at our festival. Thank you so much. Tell us your name and, 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 and the, uh, your affiliation with your project. Okay, my name is Sam Oldham, and together with Elliot, we made J and J. Elliot Hingmoff, and I'm the producer. I'm the director and producer, and Sam here with the cameraman and editor. Very good. Yeah, uh, wonderful, wonderful project. Uh, <laughs> very, very uh, extremely heartwarming and, and so inspirational. It kind of teaches us that life is gives us uh, obstacles, but through obstacles, they get us opportunities for so, so much more sometimes. Uh, but wh how did you come across doing this project? Well, we were working with them on other projects, and the subject just came up, and it seems very natural. I, uh, my first documentary was on someone very close to me who passed away, so it was hard for me to really uh, gear up the emotion to be able to do this, but I'm very grateful to be a part of this, and uh, I was so inspired by their story. It was fantastic, and I'm just so grateful to be uh, part of uh, the community. Thank you, Thank you, Well, you guys, Elliot and Sam did a phenomenal job on this film, and they put their heart and soul into it. Sam lived it for a year straight, and of course, there would be nothing without the amazing inspiration and courageous people, Joanne and Jose, and their families and their friends. I mean, you guys, every person that's in this room is so special in their own way. And the way you supported these heroes, these everyday heroes who get up and they take life on when life can be darker than a lot of us know it. And we got these amazing people in this room like Flynn Robinson and Coach Charmin and Dennis Murphy, all here to support Joanne and Jose and their families and friends. Thank you, everybody, for being there for Eagle and all of us. Thank you. The best documentary feature goes to J and J.
Critics' Choice Award for Best Documentary Feature goes to J and J. Come on down, J and J. So they provide the most important That is what's up. Congratulations. Thank you so much. <laughs> Movie stuff. <I'm> <laughs>